Hey guys, I'm Johnny Scoville and this is Chase the Heat. You know what time it is, people. It's time for that. It's late night snack time with the Scoville Squad. Mount Olive Hot Okra. Man, they've been doing this since 1926, people. Hot Okra. Okra is one of those weird deals, man. You either like it or you don't. You know, it's got a weird sort of texture. Like, have you ever had okra? Sometimes I've had okra that seems soggy and like, like there's something gnarly going on inside. Just be honest with you. Then I've had okra that was so good. So I guess that's how you make it. Uh, all right. Let me read you the ingredients of this fine product. I don't know if it's fine yet, but I, I'm one of those guys who likes okra. I don't like it when it tastes like there's a slug inside it. You know what I mean? But when they taste good, it's, you know, I think for the people that don't like it, texture is probably a substantial issue. All right, okra, water, vinegar, salt, calcium chloride, a firming agent. Uh, sodium benzoate as a preservative, a preservative, natural and artificial flavors. Polysorbate 80 and turmeric for color. It's hot. Where do you think the hot's coming from? You hear anything hot in there? I guess the natural, uh, natural and artificial flavors is where the heat's going to come in. There's no peppers or anything floating in it, or it would say, that I'd see it and you'd, say, you'd hear it on the list. But all right, we're gonna find out. It just smells like pickles. You know. Get some spices in there. All right. Here's what your okra looks like. If you haven't seen it, I'm sure you have. There are people in different countries that may have never seen okra before. You've never seen okra. This is what okra looks like. How close. It's got kind of a weird texture to it. It's a pretty weird vegetable. I'm not going to lie to you. All right. Mount Olive. Hot okra. I'm Johnny Scoville. This is Chase to Eat. It's got to be like the, the, it must be a million seeds inside this. Have you ever cut okra? Okra. Okra, not the, let me see what this looks like. Hang on, just a minute, I'll show you what the. They're your okra seeds. Kind of cool, huh? A lot of seeds, like nothing but seeds. Like this plant wants to make more of itself. Pickled okra. I don't know how to describe okra. Okra. It's like, what does okra taste like? It tastes like okra. So I'm not sure what to tell you. Um, it tastes like okra to me. Pickled okra. You notice I haven't talked about the heat? You know why that is? Now listen, I don't want to just sound like I'm complaining. My tolerance is very high right now. They should just call it spicy okra. 
Because even somebody who's not a chili and eats this, it's spicy, it's not hot. Or I'm just like really broken. I mean, it tastes good, I'm not upset with it. It's not those mushy slug inside a fibrous vegetable cocoon. It tastes good, it's, it's, it's you know, hot okra. No, hot okra, it's just okra, pickled okra. It just isn't hot. I'm not complaining. I'm just complaining about their advertising. I'm not complaining about the product. You know, it is what it is. Almost has a bit of a crunch to it, which is good. Because if you take okra and go the other way, where it's mushy. If you have ever had the experience of eating a mushy, soggy, Gnarly okra. Please go to the comment section and say so. I hope it's not just me. They're tasty. Do I like them? Yeah. Would I buy them again? No. No, I would. Here's what I would do. I can even do it with this. I can throw some peppers in there and just let it sit for a while. It's not bad. It's just not hot. Here's what it is. It was tasty though, I'm not complaining about that. Not all of people, they've been doing this since 1926. Maybe the people from Mount Olive will look at this. I doubt they will. I noticed there was no peppers in the ingredients. Maybe that's why it's not hot. Kooky, huh? I don't know. I'm weird that way. Seriously. For how much it cost them to redo a new label with the word hot on there, they could just put a little bit of pepper in them. Anyhow, if you've had this okra and you think that I'm off base, let me know. I still like the taste of it. Please understand that. I'm definitely going to eat the rest of them. It's not, not hot. So if I am wrong and you've had these and you're like, man, they're smoking hot, please go to the comment section and tell me I'm wrong. My my skin is YouTube thick. I can take it. Uh, if you've had these and you think that I probably ought to just say spicy instead of hot, let me know. But there it is, people. Not all of hot okra. Since 1926. You know? All right, people. We're going to wrap this thing up. Thank you for hanging out with me. Tomorrow, as I said earlier, tomorrow, one way or another, some peppers are getting eaten. And that's the way it's going to be. Hopefully, David gets his results back. If he does, we'll eat them together. If not, we got a big job ahead of me. Guys, right there is our pepper. Click that pepper. If you've never clicked it, click it. Become part of what we're doing, okay? It's really exciting. Be part of this. If you haven't, uh, if you don't want to miss a video, click the bell for notification. Miss nothing. Legal Fire right there. Um, just creating a momentum by a world ranking system in a way that you can get into the Legal Fire. Tomorrow, look for the date for that. It's going to be in November. Obviously, the tail end of November, but I haven't picked the date yet. But we'll be doing that soon, so be looking for that tomorrow. More videos there. Man, thank you for taking the time to watch this silliness. I love you guys. I'm Johnny Scoble. This was Chase Steve.